Good evening. Tonight, anger is brewing in the community after a horse collapsed during Friday night's Condi Cavaliers Parade in Mobile. We are about to show you that video, but just a note, some folks might find it hard to watch. At the center of all of this outrage is a parade horse carrying a grown man. Video shows what happened after the animal then buckled down to the ground. Here screaming and shouting, parade goers could only stand by and watch as a man leading a parade horse already down on the ground proceeds to then yank the animal by the reins. Riding on top of that horse is a full grown man in costume. Several people reached out to us claiming they saw the horse punched and kicked repeatedly and said the animal was struggling to walk during the entire parade. Take a listen and have a look from another angle. And from this angle, you can see that costume rider propped up on the street moments after that horse collapsed here. Again, it happened so fast. We're showing you that angle again. Clearly, there was a lot of uproar and criticism during Friday night's parade and even today as anger over the handler's actions continues to boil over. Danny Zimmern is the organizer of the Pensacola Mardi Gras parade. He told me tonight Pensacola's parades have a strict no pets policy. That includes no dogs and no horses. And it is for the safety of spectators and the animals who, again, are not allowed for this reason. I believe that other Gulf Coast Mardi Gras celebration parades do ask, uh, do allow crews to borrow, rent, use horses. I think the crew members pay a fee, and I don't exactly know where the horses come from. I will tell you, as a parade organizer in Pensacola, we've had people who have stables call us and ask us if we have any need or interest, and we, we do not. Zimmern couldn't comment specifically on this video you are watching, but he told me he hopes horses and other animals that are part of other parades are treated respectfully and humanely. We have heard that Mobile's police chief is considering some policy changes to the way horses are used in parades in light of what happened that night. The Condi Cavaliers just released a statement about the incident in the last half hour to, in their words, clear up some misinformation that is circulating. Here it is, as explained by the trainer, the horse is healthy, but became anxious due to the crowd noise and it lay down. While doing so, the marshal's foot became tangled in the stirrup requiring him to exit the saddle. That statement goes on to say we are unaware of any health related issues or medical treatment for any of the leased animals.